What is up guys, Sawchasm here, and today I have for you guys a UMP45 MOAB playing some domination on the map underground using the attachments Rapid Fire and Extended Mags, aka the Manimal class, call it what you want. I don't really care. But this MOAB, I think I died once in this game right from the start within like two points of the domination score. Then I just went on this streak right away, so it was pretty good and you know, right from the start of the game, so that's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, so basically for the most part of this game, basically what I did was control this whole left side, which is really my favorite area to patrol on this map underground, especially in Domination. If your team has the C and B flag, it's really easy to find out where they're spawning. Usually they'll spawn underground down, those long, down that long area like where I just looked, but all the way down there on those stairs, you can usually catch a few of them spawn there if you just kind of wait. And it's really good if you have marksman, really good strategy, though I wouldn't recommend it with a submachine gun with relatively high recoil, such as the UMP. You know, it's not the greatest long range weapon, so if you're going to use that strategy, I would suggest either an MP7 or some kind of assault rifle that also does well in close range encounters. So, And then I also like to come over to this area over here. You get a good look over it directly at the A flag, and you could also kind of get a better view with the people who are coming out of that underground passage and you can really take them out easy you have a really good vantage point looking down over there and it's really easy to take them out overall and pretty good strategy for getting Moab that's basically what I would suggest you do just make sure you have the C and B flags first control those flags then it'll make this whole thing a lot easier you see this is uh, pretty much the route I run I just run around here kind of in a loop through this underground passage I either come from down where that guy's looking that I just killed I either come from that way back to the stairs or from the stairs down and come back this way that I'm running now. And either way, it's a really good strategy and it works really well. But I don't want to spend the whole time talking about this gameplay in particular. Basically, what I want to talk about is my addiction. Yes, I have an addiction in Call of Duty. I mean, as if being addicted to the game wasn't enough. So I really feel like I am addicted to getting Moabs. And I mean, there's a couple reasons why I like it so much. One, I feel like it sets you a goal, like just being a relatively high kill streak at 24 gun kills with hardline. I feel like, you know, at first that seemed really hard and really challenging, but now it's not so much. But I still feel like it is a really, it's just a goal, something to work towards each game. And that's one of the things that I really like about it. You know, I, I set goals for myself for pretty much everything I do, and I try my best to reach them. But uh, MOABs are just one of those other things and I feel like they kind of set a goal for you by doing that and on top of that I like that it's all guns gun kills so it kind of makes you a little bit of a better player just by using specialists alone and just going for the MOAB so I don't know I, I really am addicted to them now the reason I'm bringing this up is because you know Black Ops 2 is around the corner this is my MOAB by the way I'm just gonna talk a little bit over this next streak I do go on another streak here say I kill myself to try to get the double but yeah Black Ops 2 is right around the corner will it include the Moab I'm not sure uh, probably not is my guess because you know Treyarch doesn't have a history of including anything like this in their previous games so I really wouldn't expect it but you know if it did happen that would be really cool but I mean I don't know I will be kind of disappointed if they took it out of the game I guess that's kind of the point that I wanted to get across I'm not really sure there was really no point in saying that or in this topic but I don't know I just want to hear your guys opinion on this would you want to see the MOAB or some variation of it come back you know in Modern Warfare 2 they had the nuke and in my opinion I felt that it was a little bit too easy to get maybe you guys disagree but I definitely feel like it was a little bit easier than say the Moab just because you had the uh, the kill streaks that pretty much did all the work for you and actually led up to the nuke compared to the MOAB, which only you know you could only get the gun kills for, and that's it. And on top of that, the nuke finished the game; it won the game for you. Whereas the Moab only wipes the team once, which is still good, but I feel like it's a little little bit more balanced. And I really do enjoy the Moab more than the nuke. I really. Wasn't a huge fan of going for nukes, I don't know. I, I've gotten a couple, almost as much as I got Moabs. Alright, not that much. I lied. Because I do have like 300 Moabs at this point, I think. But yeah, I did get some nukes. I did enjoy it, but not as much as I do going for Moabs. It kind of gives me a good rush. But I don't know, let me guys know. Would you guys like to see the Moab return in Black Ops 2? 
and that's really what I want to find out. And anyway, guys, that's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you hated it, be sure to leave some hateful comments, dislike the video, and unsubscribe. Thanks for watching. Bow!